morning, everybody. How are you? I hope that you are having a very blessed Advent season while we are preparing and waiting to celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ on Christmas. Um, this is our third week, and this is joy. And um, I always remember joy being described to me when I was a child as Jesus, that's for J, O, being others, and Y, being yourself. So you put Jesus first in whatever he wants you to do for others, and then yourself comes after that. And so joy is different than happy, and I wanted to kind of um, have you think about that a little bit, because joy is something that God can give us, and it's deeper than happy, because happy depends on a lot of times our situation, or we get what we want, or we're eating something delicious, but it changes as soon as our mood changes. But joy comes because we know the truth about ourselves, who we are. We know that Jesus loves us. We know our parents love us. And we know that we have friends and um, people like Pastor Chrissy and Pastor Andy and I who very much love you as well. And um, Jesus and the Holy Spirit provide this. And when we realize how much he loves us, he has a purpose for you. Um, then I think we all start to begin to feel joy, no matter what our circumstances are. Hmm? So I'm happy when I get a gift. But a real gift for me comes when I use that gift and I think about the person that gave me that gift every time I use it. I think about the person and I think about um, how much it means to me that that person thought of me. And um, that's what Jesus thinks of you when he sees you. He has joy and he created you to have joy and a relationship with him also. But he has joy every time he thinks of you every day. And I have joy when I think of you also. So I hope you have a really good Advent week. And um, let's pray. Joy is a smile that begins deep within. It rises and rises. We smile and laugh. To have joy means to be happy and to have what we need.